lucky for you now You got two minutes of my time And I don't really break too easily But I'm worth it Cause I'll slip into your dreams tonight Oh, So give me, so give me your all I'll take it, I'll take it to Mars Oh, I'll stick like glue inside your mind Just watch me break it So we've just arrived at the hotel. When we arrived, we were like gobsmacked at how gorgeous the hotel is. I'm gonna show you later on um, what it looks like. I think there's someone coming and I'm vlogging, how strange. Um, I'm gonna show you later on what the hotel actually looks like, like the reception area and the restaurants. But we've just arrived into our room. Oh my God. So when we checked in, they gave us like these cold towels, which were amazing and they smelled so nice. And I've never ever had that kind of reception before from a hotel. And we got taken to our room, which you would have just seen a minute ago on the buggy. And oh my God, I'm gonna show you this room tour now. I am so amazed. So when you first walk in, this is what you see here. So we actually got, um, upgraded to a family suite and so there's two extra beds there obviously we won't need to use those but this is the room here and then the bathroom is in here I love the design of this bathroom hi um, it's all like marble interior which I love and then you've obviously got the shower there oh no that's not the shower that's the toilet <laughs> there you go and um, the shower and the bath as well and it's got a rainfall shower as well which is just amazing and the best bit, oh look at Callum, he's already been in there, is we've got a swim-up pool. So, you walk out to this amazingness. How gorgeous is that? <laughs> Callum! <laughs> Sorry! <laughs> you drenched them. So yeah, me and Callum are just feeling super, super happy right now and super grateful. And I am just gonna go get in the pool. I'll catch up with you guys later. So guys, we're now just um, walking around the hotel. We are just exploring because we don't really know much about the hotel. Like we've obviously Googled it and stuff and we've looked on their website, but we haven't actually seen all of it yet. So we're now looking around really bright so yeah I, oh my god I feel like my dress is like neon <laughs> in this camera so yeah we're just looking around now and um, I'm gonna look at all the restaurants and then book in for restaurant times and stuff and all of that jazz so I will now show you around the hotel once I see what So I think this is another pool, um, there are like multiple pools in this hotel, there's also like six restaurants and like four or five bars, so we really don't know how we're going to find a way around here. Cream. Like, look, they've even got clothing. Like men's clothing, women's be, clothing. Won't be faking there, are they? Yeah, I know. Mad. 
It's not looking in a shopping centre, guys. Guys, just look at this thing here. I don't know if you can see it actually. Like that is crazy. Should I stand on the stage? <laughs> 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 what the fuck? It's so big. That's where you're gonna you're gonna do a um a performance tonight, aren't you? <laughs> okay guys, so we're going for dinner. This is the outfits of the evening. Callum, what are you wearing? A pair of grey trousers, loafs. I thought black tea. Yeah, where are they from? For the boyfriends in the back? I think they're from Boohoo, the trousers. The t-shirt's Tommy Hilfiger and the loafers are top man, I believe. There you have it. So my outfit is just a um, two-piece and it is obviously polka dot black and white and it's from Sheen. And then I've just paired it with my heeled sandals from Primark. And then I'm just wearing some hoops. I'm pretty sure that these are from Primark as well. They're just the standard silver ones. And that is it. Put my hair up. So we're off out. Good morning, everyone. It is day two in Greece, and we are just about to go for breakfast. This is the first morning that we have had breakfast here. And last night was really good, actually. We went for dinner, and then we just had a walk around the whole like resort because it's massive and you could definitely get lost in this place. Hi, Cal. You're always so quiet. You never say hi to them. So rude. Hey, girlfriends. <laughs> so this is my outfit for breakfast. This top is just from Sheen. This um, skirt, where the flipping heck is this skirt from, Cal? Oh yeah, it's from Primark. And then my um, flip flops are just the 90p ones from Primark as well. And then I'm just wearing these sunglasses from Boohoo. So we're going to go for breakfast now. Come on, MV. So, guys, we're just sat in this pod that's in the reception area. <laughs> it's got like sound effects and everything. Are you nice and relaxed? Tired. <laughs> oh, Callum. Hey guys, so Shut long up. Can't join me. <laughs> Sorry. Callum wants to go for a nap and I don't want to because last I'm year we went on <laughs> last year when we went on holiday to Mallorca, mm -hmm. I was napping pretty much every day, probably oh. about four o'clock, five o'clock. Oh. And then you'd get ready oh. for dinner. What Callum? No. <laughs> and we'd get ready for dinner. <laughs> and then go but this year i don't want a nap because i think that sometimes naps can make you feel worse comment below if you agree with me because i definitely on holiday sometimes feel worse after a nap so i want to stay awake i want to kind of just chill edit some videos read a book then get ready for dinner then have some drinks and go to bed that is my ideal evening so that's probably what we're going to do I'm not going to lie, me and Callum had some drinks by the pool and I proper felt it. Proper. Proper. Proper, proper mate. Proper <laughs> I am not a regular drinker. Like, I don't drink very often. And I had this, what was it called? Berry daiquiri. Oh my God, guys. I it was. It was amazing. At our hotel, you can probably see it from here, I'll show you in a minute, but it is closed. It closed at six. So it's a swim up pool bar and we have pretty much been living there since we've arrived. So we'll go for a swim, land up at the pool bar, get a drink, then get out, sunbathe. And I ordered this berry daiquiri, which I've never had before. I just said to them, I was like, can I see the cocktail menu? So he let me see it and I ordered this berry daiquiri which I've never ordered before and I am in love. It is so nice, Callum even liked it, you said it was really nice didn't you? It literally tastes like jelly, 
but a juice. Oh, so, me being me, I thought I could handle it. Had a few, and I was drunk. I feel okay now. Oh God, look at that. <laughs> I feel okay now, but I proper felt the effect of alcohol. I'm just proper. saying proper. So I feel okay now. I've edited a video. I've had a swim in our little pool and I feel okay now. But oh my God, if I'd carried on, I wouldn't have made it to dinner. <laughs> I wouldn't have made it to dinner, I'm telling you now. Callum was okay, weren't you? I think you were a little bit tipsy. You just didn't admit it. I, th I think he was, guys. I think Callum lies about how drunk he feels. You know when I'm drunk. So yeah, I'm currently just sat by the pool. I think Callum will probably end up going for a nap and I'm just gonna sit here and read because I feel like even though I've been sat by the pool trying to read, I haven't really read as much as I could have. So I'm gonna sit here and read my book. I've edited my video, it's all good. And you know, just having the best day ever. Hey guys, so we got back from dinner, like, <laughs> ages ago now, like four hours ago, but me and Callum have just been sat on our little terrace area, just talking for ages, and we didn't realise what time it was. <laughs> okay then. <laughs> so I'm going to show you a little clip um, from the outfit of the night, and Ooh, I'm going to turn my camera around. So I'm just wearing this kind of two-piece, but they're not from the same um, place. They're actually from different places. Oh, just made my belt come undone. Um, so this top is from Sheen. It's just like a square neck crop top, which I really, really like. And then I've paired it with this ribbed um, knitted skirt, which is from Boohoo. And then this belt is um, the leopard print one. This is also from Boohoo. Um, I'm wearing my leopard print earrings, which are also from Boohoo, and then I've paired it with my black heeled sandals. Camera's not focusing. <laughs> and these are from Primark. So, yeah, that is my outfit of the night, guys. So we're now going <laughs> to... What are you doing? You're such a weirdo. Callum's just... I'm not even going to explain That's what That's naked. <laughs> <laughs> so um, we're now just going to go to bed, but we're going to watch Love Island first on catch up. Um, this lighting is doing bits, guys. This mirror. We've got like his and her sinks and like mirrors that have lights behind. So good doing my makeup in here. But yeah, we're going to go to bed now and watch Love Island. And then I'm going to get up really early tomorrow and we're going to go to the gym. Because... Your girl has put on some pounds today from all the crappy food that I've eaten and all of the drink as well. So we're going to do that and I will see you all tomorrow. Two days running now, we have overslept. So for literally the past two days, we've been meaning to go, for, go to the gym in the morning. Callum woke up and was like, so it's eight o'clock. I meant to go to the gym at seven. Because someone turned the alarm off. She's more than capable of setting an alarm. Right, guys. There is no need to set two alarms. I left it in his capable hands to set the alarm and wake me up. You don't need to set another alarm. Comment down below if you agree with me. And also, excuse my um, sunburnt nose. That's fab, isn't it? <laughs> So we're going down for breakfast now and I'll catch up with you all later. Hey guys, so I've been a little bit mute today, so sorry about that. We had breakfast and then we just chilled by the pool all day, so there's not really been much footage to film. We are actually going for dinner now. We're just going to the main restaurant. We have booked for the fine dining restaurant because in this hotel there are like eight restaurants. No, is it eight or is it six? I think it's six. 
and um, I think there's like five bars. So the restaurants, some of them you need to book for. So you've got like a fine dining restaurant, a Italian, an American, Greek, Mediterranean, all of different like types of food. So we've booked for, what's going on with my shaky hand? So we've booked for the fine dining one tomorrow and then we've booked for the Italian one, was it Sunday? On Sunday and then we're gonna book for the American one on Monday. You can book on the app, so everyone I think in the hotel books on the app, but literally you can only book from 10 until 6 on the app and I think everyone must book literally bang on 10 because we tried to book at like 13 minutes past 10 and loads of tables were booked. So I think for the um, Italian one on Sunday we actually managed to get a table but it was at quarter past 9 so it's quite late. And then the fine dining one we're eating tomorrow at 8 o'clock. But if you ever do stay here, I don't even think I've told you the name of this hotel. <laughs> so the name of this hotel is the Atlantica Dreams Resort and Spa. And it's in Rhodes in Greece. And it is so, so lovely. I would highly recommend anyone who's looking for a hotel in Greece that is all inclusive. Because it is so, so lovely. And you will have seen from some of the clips that I've put into this video what the hotel looks like. I do need to do you a proper tour. But we just haven't really thought about it yet so I will um, insert a tour into this video at some point later on or maybe in the part two because this is part one of the vlog and there's going to be a part two as well that's coming out next week so yeah stay tuned for that because the hotel is so amazing and I really highly recommend so for dinner this evening I've kind of gone like a casual glam so I'm wearing the same top that I wore yesterday, which is the one from Sheen, it's just a black square neck one. And then I'm wearing these like floaty trousers from Primark, which I just love the colour of these. I think they're so lovely and they're really flattering as well. And then again, I'm wearing these. These are like my favourite shoes for dinner this holiday and also the white ones because I just think that they make an outfit look really glam and I really like that. So we're going to go for dinner now and then we are going to maybe watch a show or maybe go to the bar and have some drinks. Not really sure yet what we're doing but I will keep you updated. Good morning everyone, it is day... Good morning everybody! He literally made me jump. <laughs> He just has to always announce himself. Look how sunburnt my face is. Tan my face is compared to yours. Yeah, I know. My face does not tan whatsoever. Anyone else get that? Like my body will tan, but my face stays the same. And then I'll get the sunburnt nose. Okay. Anyway, it is day five here in Rhodes and is it day five? Day five? Yeah, it is. It's day five. And we are literally just gonna do nothing today. We are sunbathing. For the past few days we have sunbathed. I think I didn't film yesterday because we were just relaxing. But yeah, we are going to just be relaxing today. We went for a meal last night at the, it's called Gaia, Gower, Gaia, Gaia restaurant. And that is the fine dining restaurant that is here. And it was so, so nice. You can pick like a three course meal if you want to. We didn't. I got a starter and a main and Callum just got a main because he didn't like any of the starters. So I got like this cauliflower soup. Oh, it was so nice. And then I got um, a risot beetroot risotto, which was also amazing. And then Callum got the pork fillet, which you said was really nice, didn't you? I tried a little bit, it was nice. It's not enough of it. Yeah, it was just quite small because obviously fine dining portions are quite small anyway and Callum was not expecting it. <laughs> he was really disappointed. I was starving. <laughs> yeah, Callum eats a lot if you lot haven't gathered yet. Um, so tonight we're going for a meal at Caprice. It's the Italian restaurant and we've had a look at the menu. I'm actually quite excited because I love Italian food. Um, but I'm not really sure what I'm going to order yet. I need to have a look again, actually, to see what starters. We don't normally get desserts because I do like a dessert now and then, but Callum's not a sweet person, so he, he'll not eat any dessert. And then I'm kind of sat there like, I don't really want to eat if he's not. And most of the time I'm full anyway, so there's just no point. 
So yeah, we're going there tonight. Um, tonight our table's booked quite late. It's at quarter past nine because it's the only table that we could get. But we are going to try and get into this um, American restaurant because every time we have tried to book, it has been full in like, th literally yesterday I tried to book for it and it was booked in three minutes. No slots left. It was absolutely mental. So we're going to try and book into that tonight. No, not tonight, for Tuesday night because you have to book for the two nights ahead which is just mental but anyway guys I'm going to wrap up this video here I really hope that you enjoyed it if you did please do not forget to click the like button and also subscribe if you're new if you have made it to the end thank you very much <laughs> I know it's quite a long video there is going to be a part two to this vlog which will be coming out next week on Wednesday yeah I think I'm posting it on Wednesday and I will see you all in the next video bye